Hello, everyone, and welcome back to FIVA Gaming. FIVA Gaming! Apparently, Mr. Anita's been sleeping for what? Two weeks now? Yep. Uh, yes, he, he's back. We're here. We're gonna do some more farming. It's, uh, it's raining outside right now. I'm all and it And it's day three. Yeah, it is day three. Uh, we may have slept and ignored an entire day. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Now, does rain affect plant growth in any way? It, in fact, makes it so you don't even have to water. Huzzah! So, I'm, I'm just going to light the fire here, because we want to have a fire in the fireplace. We want to be nice and cozy when we get back. Can we expand the house size? Uh, we all? can. It's going to take a lot of money, but yes, we can. Okay, okay. We got some mail. Ah, just got back from a fishing trip. Should come down to the beach sometime. Got something for ya, Willy. I hope it's not as Willy. <laughs> At least it's a little Willy. Mm. I, I, I don't want that. <laughs> I, don't, I don't swing that way. I don't know about Mr. Amoeba, though. Mr. Amoeba might swing that way. Well, I'm not Mary Lewis, and I just do the voice. Well, to be fair, I expect Mary Lewis will swing any way he feels like. Yes. For all I know, he's been humping this tree in our sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Just, uh, I call him Jasper. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm just gonna cut him down right now. He's not allowed to have this thing not anymore. No, Jasper. There he goes. <laughs> Let's make sure he doesn't do anything to the stump either. <laughs> All right, now we got uh, we got, we got ourselves some wood. Some morning wood, if you will. <laughs> uh, oh. oh, that's right. We have a we have a cockle. All right, so here's what we're gonna do, right? Mm -hmm. I believe we have enough to. Oh no, we no we don't. All right, so we're gonna take down another one of Mary Lewis's favorite trees. Do you have any idea what this one's name is? Um, no. Well, it doesn't matter. It's gonna die in about what? There we go. Come on. Get rid of the stump too. All right, there we go. Now I should be able to go ahead and... Yes! Alright, so, because we don't have much storage space, we're going to want a chest. Mm. Now, where do you want me to put it? Where do you want the chest, sir? Can it go inside the house? Not saying that inside would be a better place for it. Uh, it can go inside the house. However, I think it's better outside, especially if you're going to store your produce in there. Oh, okay, okay. Um... What would you say would be a good place to do it? Because can we can we move it once we place it? Oh, yeah. You're just going to have to take everything out of it. But, yes, you can move it. Oh, okay. Because maybe on the opposite side of the house than the mailbox? Uh, like right here? Yes, that's perfect. That'll be good for now. Although, once we start getting more, because we're going to probably want more of these. Uh, oh, it might okay. Get a little messy. But for now, this is fine. Okay, uh, okay. And how much storage space does that have? This, sir, has quite a lot. Like oh, I so it's like double my inventory. Triple, actually. Triple as of right now. Because uh, we I... only have this top row to work with. Oh! Oh, and we have four lines now. This has uh, three layers. And, we have and three my layers. one line. We have one line. We can get upgrades to backpacks as well, but again, money. Uh, mm -hmm, and we'll unlock mm -hmm. layers as we get more backpacks. Also, we can change the color. What color do you want this to be? That pop noise sounds very satisfying. Yes, yes, it does. Um, maybe a blue chest. Uh, regular like, blue or lighter blue? Dark blue. There you go. All right. All right. So, actually, what am I doing here? Open chest. Here. We get rid of that. We get rid of this. Uh, we get rid of that. Let me see here. I'm trying to remember how... There we go. Uh... Because this auto... I'm trying to remember how to play. It's so sad. It's been so long. Also, uh, this is where we can also start making money by throwing stuff in this box. As Creeper Lewis, if you recall, will be coming back to get this every night. Make an offering to Mary Lewis. I'm going to offer him three daffodils. Is that okay with you? 
That's fine. Let's get rid of this crap. Alright, that opens up another inventory slot for us now. Oh god, I hope he doesn't get the wrong idea. <laughs> he, he might. He might just do that. Alright, here we go. We also have the new quest to the beach. Uh, who haven't we actually met yet? Uh, um, 17 people. Well, yes, but uh, here. This will tell us who we haven't met yet, because their names will be questioned. We haven't met this guy, this kid, this girl. Alright, there's a few here we haven't met yet. Oh, hi, hey, there's Robin. Alright. I, I don't know if I mentioned this last time, or in our, like... First cut that didn't turn out that well, but Robin's kind of cute. She's taken, sir. You do not get that option. Mm. By the way, uh, did you just see what I did? You hit the ground and got copper ore. I hit the ground because there were uh, worms there that you can see. If you hit it with the hoe, it'll pop up something. In this case, it was three copper ore. Mm. I don't want that. Give me a leak. Give me some daffodils. Or no, dandelions. What am I saying? I don't know. All right, we're gonna go off. See if we can meet some people. Okay. Also, as I believe I mentioned in the last episode, their daily routines change. Mm. Uh, based on weather, based on the time of year. We got here. Looking for a catfish. Cash payment on delivery. Uh, huh. Accept it. We'll accept it. Do we want? Do we want to head in? See how Pierre is doing. Eh, maybe a little later. All right, all right. We can stop down by the beach, you know, because we have that. Uh, we have that ladder. Okay. We can do that. Okay, we can do. We can go to the beach. You know, I am very curious how Mr. Aviva keeps his afro so perfectly round, especially in this rain. I don't actually have an afro, so I wouldn't know. Well, you don't, but Mr. Aviva does. Yes, yes. Probably lots and lots of hair gel. <laughs> But he just goes to bed and wakes up in the morning. Like, he doesn't do anything with it. It's a, so much hair gel, it's a solid dome of hair. Shh, plot. <laughs> now, do you want me to do this, or are you going to take it? I mean, I'm trying to think of a... Ahoy there, son! Right. Hey, there was a newcomer in town! Good to finally meet ya! I don't like you. I'm still trying to win wine from a month out on the salty sea! Arrgh! Willie, do you have a hook for a hand? Or a peg leg? I... Sir, are you, are you a pirate? Oh, no I'm not. Arrgh. Do you see a pie patch on me? <laughs> I'd not be a pirate. <laughs> it was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. By fish, do you mean money? Finally, they not buy me a new rod. Uh. Here, well, why did you have my old fishing rod? So, so you mean the crappy one? Oh no, it's my old one. Arr. But it's broken in two. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just use a little bit of duct tape. <laughs> it's important to me that the auto fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. A new fishing rod. That could be. That could be. Arr. It's a bamboo pole. It's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. As, as opposed to bad water? Yeah, yeah. I mean, if the BP oil spill happened, sure, but I don't see an oil rig here. Oh, yeah. My shop's back open now. Come by if you need supplies. Arr. Are you sure you're not a pirate? No, no. Just a verbal tick. Arr. I'll, I'll buy anything you catch. 
If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old papas used to say anyway. Well, sir, I have this lump of brown stuff here. <laughs> it smells quite bad. Will it sell? Uh, I don't know. Let me take a whiff. <laughs> <laughs> just shoves it in his face. <laughs> my own personal brand of manure. <laughs> Hey, hey, this one actually dropped itself here rather than just at the start of the town. Hmm, interesting. Alright, so, I'm gonna show you the wonderful mechanic known as fishing, alright? Now we just wait for the fish to reel in. Like that. And then, you just gotta make sure, by constantly clicking, that you keep the green... Oh, God. I'm gonna have to fix that. The green square inside the fish. Unplug that. So if you would cl have clicked quote unquote better, would we have caught a bigger fish? Uh, no. The fish is defined immediately upon catching it. Like immediately upon getting hit on the uh, rod. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. So even if you would have clicked so, so fast, it would have hit the top, I would have still got the sardine. It would have still been a fish. It would have still been a sardine. Uh, mm. You can tell the differences between them based on how difficult they are to reel in. Like you'll you'll okay. be able to tell which fish is better or worse or whatnot. Okay, um, so you could choose to just to give up if it's. You could, but you lose energy each time you cast. Oh, oh, also, I forgot about the energy mechanic. Also, if you recall, we only have a certain amount of time in the day. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So, uh, you could, but it's more worth it, I would say, to get it, just in case, you know, for money's sake, you're getting something. Mm-hmm. And since, uh, you also get better fish as you get better holes, I believe, too. Like, this one's probably still, yep. So, oh, no, it's a herring. Okay, okay. But, so uh, then what's the purpose of clicking to make the bar rise? Uh, the clicking... Well, the idea is, like, you know the green bar that's in there, right? Yeah, I saw the... Clicking rises I... the bar, um, and not clicking drops the bar. You need to keep mm -hmm. that fish within that bar. Ah. Also, there are chances where, uh, you could hit fish, right? And mm -hmm. all of a sudden you'll get a treasure chest popping up in there. And it's the same idea as with the fish. If you can keep mm -hmm. the bar on the treasure chest long enough... Oh, here we go, perfect example, watch. Now we got that treasure chest so long as we get mm. the fish. As long as my skill isn't failing miserably, which, you know, I, I'm not doing too well here right now. Ah, come on. Nope, nope. There. Yep. Eh. Oh, better. so you're the rightmost bar. The rightmost bar, uh, you know, the one that's uh, going okay. up is... Uh, yeah, okay, because... Yeah, because I thought you were the small green rectangle. I am the small green rectangle. Oh. Uh, that's just the amount of time you need to have the uh, fish within that bar. Ah, You need to ah. fill that up. And it lowers if you're not have if the fish isn't within your green bar that you control. Ah. Okay, okay. So the minute that bar on the uh, right side maxes out, you get your fish. Oh, okay. So we caught an anchovy this time. And we also mm -hmm. got this thing. We got some coal. Which we don't have space okay. for. What do we throw out? Uh... Dandelion? Probably the best choice. Now, see, this is where it would be very nice to have a spare backpack. You know, just mm, fill mm -hmm. this up. Unfortunately, we don't have that right now. Now, also, if you notice, like, uh, as I scroll over, like, uh -huh. the fish here, you can see health and energy. So we so... can get back some energy by eating f uh, food. Mm-hmm. Or here's the league, we can get 40 back from that. And I may be dating myself here since I am a few years older than you, but wasn't there some kid show with, like, some backpack song? You're talking Dora the Explorer. So yes, there was. There was also a map song. And other uh, horrible, horrible things. Huh. <laughs> 
but yes, I think these three fish are all we're gonna get right now until we get a better rod okay. or the uh, time of the year changes. Okay, okay. So e eating them can boost our energy, but selling them can give us more money. Yes, it can. Hmm. And you know, the better the quality of the fish, mm -hmm. uh, the more you're gonna get for it. Yeah. Because there are like these are just common versions, right? There is mm -hmm. like silver star version or gold star version, which are worth more. Okay. Unfortunately, they also take up a new another slot. Oh. Yeah. Oh god! No! 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 no. Oh, I missed it. Hmm. Uh, there's a treasure chest, and Willie's shop is closed. Oh. Oh, right. uh, I'm going home oh, now. Oh god! You saw how much that launched up. That's probably something that's not a sardine. Hmm. Also, Willie the pirate has stopped moving in the background as I try to catch my fish. Time is frozen when you fish. Arr. This might be something. Oh my god. We have an eel. Mm. We're gonna want to hold on to this one. Um, get rid of the coal? Yeah, probably best because we can get coal. We're going to want coal later, but for now, yeah. That's okay, so how about we go home and put the eel in our chest? Yeah, okay, yeah, that's probably the best idea. Unless, uh, so, we ha so we can free up some space. Yeah, yeah, that's the best idea. Out of my way, Willie. Oh, see you tomorrow. Uh, well, before we do that, do we want to, like... Do you want to throw stuff back and then come back to the beach and try fishing some more? Or do we want to try talking to other people? Uh, we can talk, talk to, we can talk to other people. Alright. Alright, uh, let me just double check who we're missing, because I vaguely remember where they're gonna be. Yeah, okay. Uh, if I had to guess... Let's see if we can just, like, break into people's places and see if they're around. Like, so we are suddenly Mayor Lewis. Oh, I finally have a protege. No one's around. Ah, oh, she's up here. She's in a room, but I can't get in. <laughs> There's a reason they keep their doors locked. They don't trust Mayor Lewis. <laughs> oh, look, here we go. Jody. My name is Jody. Did you wipe off your boots before you came in? Sorry, I just cleaned the floor. Whoa, 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 Jody, do you smoke? No, I just moved from the big city. It's actually a Game Grumps reference. <laughs> uh, I want to look for bugs, but Mom gets mad when I'm all dirty. It's a tough choice. I mean, good on you, you enjoy getting dirty. That'll help, that'll help you out when you're older. Alright, I'm um, trying to think. I should be able to get in. Actually, that's right, we haven't actually stopped in the, uh, at the saloon. Would episode 2 be too early for a Game Grumps reference? No, you don't worry about it. Okay. okay. There's the doctor. There's this schmuck. Let's see here. Uh, no, I don't have time to chat. It's a prick. This kid. Alright, uh, I think I got one. Actually, no. Do you want to take him or no? Um. Hey! Nothing like an ice cold Georgia Cola on a sopping wet day, huh? That did not sound as cool as I wanted him to sound. <laughs> Alright, uh, I got this kid here. Oh god, ugh. You just moved in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you chose to come into town. And there's this chick. You, see you can her? get her. Let me think. Uh, what kind of voice do I want to review? Uh, hmm. Oh, that's right. I heard some of new movies. Uh, number dead. Speaking is difficult. Please bear with me. <laughs> oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving into, uh, into that old farm. It's kind of a shame, really. I was always enjoy uh, I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Loner. Purple hair. Goth girl. I don't know. 
Don't mind me. I'm just gonna take everything from the barrels. Ah, I can't get to the barrels. I wanted to get in and drink all of the booze. Hmm. It's disappointing. Oh. You probably should have saved your other voice for this one, I'll be honest. <laughs> Uh, oh! Alright, I'll take it since you've used yours. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> hey, kid! Name's Pam! Ugh. Hey, kid, you're too young to be moping, uh, to be moping around in a place like this. Yeah, she, she's a doll, ain't she? Mm hmm. You want Gus or you want me to take it? Hi, Mr. Amoeba! I'm glad to see you! You're always welcome here! Is that before or after I drink him out of house at home? Because these all look delicious. <laughs> Hi there, Mr. Amoeba! I think we met before! And we got Emily here. I heard rumors of rare and powerful magic rings. Forged long ago by forgotten civilizations. I'm not sure if it's true or just a fairy tale. Uh, and then we have Leia. Miriam. Whoa! It's Hello. nice to meet you! <laughs> <laughs> you picked a good time to move in here! The spring is lovely! I believe that's, uh, yeah, that's all the valley level about her. And there's one last person in here that we haven't talked to yet. You want me to take it or you? Oh, uh, you can. Er, uh, ah, I'm Clint. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. Oh my god, that just reminds me, and I know I probably said this in a vlog like last year sometime, but my my I was recording dialogue with my friend for a project that never came to pass, but he would he could not say local blacksmith. He would always say like local blacksmith. <laughs> And Lexman. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Although I have like the fine. No, I I don't even have that bit of dialogue that he was that he had. But he, like it took him like six takes to say local blacksmith. Jesus. All right, put away the eel. Uh, put away the copper ore for later. Put away the leak. Uh, we can probably toss these into the box into the box for Lewis to just. Do God know what with? Yeah. I I don't even want to know what he does with that stuff. All right. Now I know there was some forageable stuff up here, so I'll quick grab that, throw that in the box, and I think we can go to sleep for the day. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Another dandelion. Uh, daffodil. I mean, another leaf. Now I know, I know for a fact that leaks are a thing that we might need later. Just because there's going to be a guy in town that wants one at some point. Yeah. So we got one in the box just in case. Just for when that comes around. And that's one of the bad parts about, like, friends from years ago. You never really, like, find them these yeah. days. Yeah. What? Yeah, I don't think he's on Facebook much, mm. if at if at all. Yeah, yeah. Well, good night, everybody. Mr. Amoeba's gonna take a nap. Yep. Oh, hey, look, we leveled up for foraging. Ooh. So we get better axe proficiency, so that means we're probably gonna drop trees faster. Uh, okay. They now drop seeds as well. Ooh. We can make wild seeds for spring, which I, I get why you can, but I think it's kind of useless. Because you it, basically what you need to make them is uh, all the wild stuff that you find, like the leek, the dandelion, the daffodil, and uh, the whatever the fourth one is. I'm blanking mm -hmm. on what it is. But you just make those, you get like one pack of seeds, I think. And it's like, mm -hmm. well, why? I could just turn in all the stuff I found. Yep. And I'm just wondering, do you want to do a day, a video, or uh, what's, what's, what? What time is it right now? Uh. Real time? Because I don't know what time we started at. Uh, we started at like 9.30, so what time is it right now? 
Ten ten. Yeah, it's good enough. One day per episode. Yep. So I guess that means we're signing off for now. Mr. Aviva will be back with you some other time. Maybe yep. next week. Bye. See ya. Like, favorite, subscribe, do all the other things in the descriptions and all that shiz. Laters.